Hello Facebook. Hello YouTube. Hello Twitter. Hello Instagram. I don't have an Instagram for this channel yet. Anyway, welcome to another product review with me, Jonathan. And today I'm going to be reviewing something I've previously reviewed, but this time it's a bit different. And not different in the fact that the product is different, but different in the way I got it. So, I'm going to be reviewing these Mac and Cheetos. But as you can see, they're not from Burger King. They are from a box. And I got these in my freezer aisle at my local grocer's freezer. And these are made by Frito-Lay, as you can see here. And basically, um, I've cooked these in the oven from Frozen. And here are the baking instructions. And I'll read them to you. Preheat the oven for 450. Remove products from package. Put them at least an inch apart on an ungreased baking sheet. Ungreased. Bake for 10 to 11 minutes. I went for the full 11. And let's stand for one to two minutes. Mine's been standing for more like 10 minutes. Careful, product is hot. Hopefully mine's not that hot anymore. It's moving on. Well, here's what they look like. Does it look like a plate of Cheetos? Kind of. But let's see if these frozen baked mac and Cheetos that I made at home are any different than the ones that Berkey makes. And I believe they fry theirs. So first of all, let's see what happens when I break it in half. Not much. If you look in the middle, you'll see some mac and cheese in there. Let's give it a taste. Definitely tastes just like the ones I got at Burger King. And as you can see, it's the same type of macaroni. It's like little chunks of macaroni, not even full noodles, but like little pieces of noodle. It has a nice flavor. I'll try one more, and then I'll give you my rating. Very crisp and crunchy on the outside, but nice and creamy in the middle. Okay, so out of 10, what will I give them? Well, I can't remember what I gave the Burger King ones, but I think it was at least 8, maybe even 9. So what I'm going to do is give these an 8.5. They're pretty much the same thing. They might even be a little bit better, because... It lacks like the greasy exterior and I don't really miss the fact that it wasn't fried it's really still nice and crunchy and crispy on the outside and creamy in the middle what would you dip these in probably some ranch dressing I would say would be a good option if you like them spicy maybe some sriracha sauce I have noticed online I've seen these in the in a different version it was the flame and hot mac and cheetos but when i went to the store they didn't have them they only had the regulars so that's what i got but if i do see those i'm definitely going to pick them up and i'm definitely going to make a video and i'm definitely going to put it on youtube and this is definitely the last time i'm going to say definitely except for that one
crispy and creamy. Right on the box, it says what it is. And I, that's what I've described it, and I didn't even read it. Anyway, hope you liked the video. Hope you enjoyed every minute of it, every second. Hope you come back for more. And until next time, I hope you guys really enjoy yourselves. Bye.